Hey fellow Vikings and welcome back to Valheim. Today we're diving into a building challenge which I found this morning in my recommended videos. The challenge itself is created by a creator named Splash o Pain, and I could not resist to give it a try. I will drop a link in the description to their channel. Now we're set to build a functional and cozy space using 100 wood and 5 stone and our toolkit is limited to what is available before defeating Ektir the first boss. The build must include a workbench, a bed and a chest and they all need to be fully functional and apart from that we also need to construct a campfire capable of enduring a Valheim thunderstorm. So let's see if we can rise to the occasion and create something great within these constraints. So the plan is we're going to collect some wood. Now probably we're going to build right here. That means I'm going to break this house down. So I just need a little bit of wood to get the workbench going. As you can see, I am not attacked and that's because I turned off the enemies. I just wanted to build today. I didn't want to bother about being attacked while I was building. I already got 50 wood almost. All right, let's uh, put the workbench here. Let's take this down. All right, so I got some uh, wood and stone in this chest here. So I need 100 wood and 5 stone. That is what we are allowed to build with. Also, our tools have to be all pre-ectier. My plan is to build the house right here, like a little beach house. Now, I do want to enlarge the area a little bit, so we have a bit more space. So, let's flatten this up a bit. Too bad I won't be able to use my um, cultivator to clean up the terrain a bit more and make it look like actual um, grass. Alright, so, what we, can, what we need, we need a workbench. We need a bed and we need a chest. These three things have to be in the base. Also, we need a fireplace and we need, of course, a two woods. Otherwise, we won't be able to build our fireplace. So in the end, this is what we're left with. 70 wood to build with. So the plan is, as I said, to build a little bit of a uh, beach house cabana. So let's begin with a um, short wall here. Let's see, let's make sure that we are a bit in the center here. And then two short ones on the side, then we do 45, 45. And then we build a little of a support for the roof later. And then put two short ones here, 45, 45. 25, and then here we're gonna have our door. Like that. Then the floor is going to be snapping here and here. Now, because we have used that weird angle, we're going to have like a gap of terrain in the middle. So I'm going to take a door. I'm going to snap it against the other door. So I have this lined up, which allows me to snap a new floor in the center here, overlapping with the others. Now I'm going to have to make sure that it's centered. There we go. All right. Delete the door. Then we can delete you and we can snap a wall there and then snap two walls left and right and then relieve remove that one again this is going to be the fireplace and now i'm gonna put a beam here and a beam here put one more on top and then one beam on the side so we can snap a top roof on it like that should be three in total and then on that we're gonna snap our 45 degree angle do it roof like this Then we can break that beam. Uh, we're going to leave these for the moment until I'm sure I don't need more. Um, and then we go outside. And then we can do the roof on this side as well. Now we can put the angled roof here. So we have like a... Different look on that side. There's some wood on my roof I see. So I'm going to have to point pick that up can I get inside we can get inside perfect I still have four wood left 
So the focus is going to have to be on our little um, support here. That means I'm going to have to break these away. And put these here instead. That way they are supporting my roof. And they're also going to allow me to snap my... Actually, I think I need to keep this here. I still have four wood. Does that make sense? I think so. One beam in here. Two more wood left. That means we can put the roof in there now. Like that. And then we can take the beam away again like this. And then finally... Close at the front. So now we have the fireplace like that. And that's our little cabana. Very chill. A lot of open view so we can actually see outside and have the fresh breeze coming inside. So the next thing we need to do now is just build everything 11. I'm somehow confused with the stuff I'm picking up, but okay. And then we're going to build our bed on that side making sure that's a little bit inside so we have the cover we can have the workbench on that side like that and then we're gonna build our chests right here like that and then we have one more wood and a one fireplace left there we go Let's see if this smokes up the house, but it shouldn't. I have one wood left. That's not a lot of things I can build with that, but okay. Oh, that only takes one wood. Ah. So this seems to be holding out pretty well. I'm not getting any smoke in the house, really. Although it does go around the roof. It doesn't seem to be collecting here. I'm not getting any uh, like choking. Alright, let's see if it uh, tests the time of storm. <sighs> and there we have it. Our base withstands even the worst of storms. Now it's your turn. Why not try and take on this challenge yourself? Get creative, see what you can come up with, and if you feel like it, you can share it in our Discord. If you enjoyed this video and who knows, perhaps helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Your support is greatly appreciated and it helps more people find the content. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Beer bum out.